So now let's clean up the drawing and add some more details and finish up with the doors and windows openings. So I'm going to offset this 3 feet, 3 feet, offset this, let's see how big is the door opening. The door opening is, is three feet six so I'll offset that one foot eight from here till here from here till here and I'm gonna offset this again four feet for the living room offset four feet here till here from here till here now let's trim out the openings using the trim command trim 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 and I'm going to trim them out even this direction trim trim once I trim these out I will just delete the lines that I don't need or erase them erase erase okay so these openings are done with right now now let's do even this so this one that you see over here is the toilet window so I'm going to give it an offset as one offset one foot and one foot trim it up erase trim okay so the toilet is done and what you see over here is a door and this door is the access door is three foot two. So I can offset that three foot two uh, from this side, and then just trim the opening. Okay. So the door is done. Is there a window there? There's no window there and we have this window I'm going to trim this window opening as well and erase the leftover lines so now you can see the drawing is taking shape step by step now this does take time so it does require a lot of time a lot of patience so you have to sp spend a lot of time doing the first floor and the second floor I'm going to offset this three foot on this side as well as this and another window going from here to here trim it out trim that out and trim these lines okay select select and delete now a few more things we need to add is the hallway now the hallway is four foot two and we have a little um, storage space over here which is four foot two as well so I'm going to start with this line offset four foot two going this direction offset six inches going back offset four foot two going in that direction offset six inches going down okay so this is the area that I just made so I'm going to trim out some lines that I don't need to avoid confusion now I'll trim these lines out as well okay so this is where my uh, hallway goes I have a staircase that goes from here I can always stretch this out and line my staircase with the same ok 
okay so that's the area for the staircase we have another opening over here this is not a door it's just the opening which is six foot wide so I can put that for my dining room offset it six foot and then trim out the area okay now what else can I do the next thing I have to get is to the doors now we have the door going from the carport to the kitchen if I measure it it is three foot two so I am going to have it over here offset three foot two from here till there and I will trim out the opening now after I will go to my door layer and start putting in the doors but I'm just cleaning up the drawing right now so it will take me a little bit to clean up add all these offsets all the trim the door trims to to make my drawing perfect okay these offsets I would take in as three inches so I will add all those details and um, trim it out and I'll see you in a bit so right now I trimmed out all my hallways I trimmed out my staircase area I trimmed out most of the spaces that I needed to now I'll have to put in the doors and the windows and clean up all these lines I cannot be having all these lines overlapping because that would create problems later on when I am working with uh, hatching my drawing okay so uh, the command that we use to clean up these lines is trim erase and fillet like in this case I'm gonna use F enter for fillet and my default fillet is zero so I can uh, fillet those lines here I can just do trim I'll trim out the inside ones trim trim out the inside lines trim that out over here trim 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 I could do fillet I can click on that line and this one I could click on this line and that one you could use fillet or trim either or which one whichever one works faster for you but it's extremely important you clean all your drawings and make sure that the lines are not overlapping because then that would create a lot of problems in the future okay some more trim and erase clean up my drawing I can use my grips even using grips is fine can erase these lines I'll trim this one erase okay same thing I will have to trim this one out trim all of these lines in fact trim 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 so this is time consuming but there's no way around it I can delay this and raise these lines trim again and then I will start with the doors and the windows okay I think this is good enough right now you get the idea so to start with the doors I will go to the doors layer it's extremely important that I'm working on the right layer Let's see where doors are doors is right there so I'll click on the door layer now how to draw a door there are a couple ways of drawing a door I'm going to show you an easier way starting with a line I just make a straight line I'll give it an offset of maybe uh, two inches like just the thickness of the door and then I draw a circle starting from there till here all I have to do now is just go ahead and trim and I have my door so this is the fastest way of making a door 
all you need to do is have an opening. You could always even use a template if you want for your door, uh, but again, it's up to you. So I will make another door, maybe over here, line straight up, offset two inches that direction, make a circle starting from here, going all the way up here. What I would do is trim the door and then I have my door erase the rest of the lines the so same thing I would be doing and adding doors anywhere and everywhere you s you have doors in your drawing okay now I'll have another door over here going maybe a two inch trim going back six inches and going back up again I will trim this area and I can match attributes where I put this on the wall layer now if I want to have a door here which is this door again I'll make a straight line so I hope by now you follow how to make a door offset two inches going from there going this way make a circle from the opening till the opening end and trim it out that one this one and I can erase this okay so that's taking care of the doors how would I make the windows to make the windows I make sure I go to the windows layer I make a line okay line there and a little offset maybe one inch for the glass okay maybe I'll make an offset of two inches now again you should know this is just a presentation so we don't need to work more with the detail of the window because we're just working with the design package so this is good enough right now I go again we have a door over here so I'll make a window window offset two inches and boom my window is done so I'll go one by one and finish up with my windows just by doing that offset two now the next thing that you see over here is we have the furniture now the furniture comes in AutoCAD as a template and we can go find it in uh, in let's see where to go find it in insert yeah it's in insert and insert from the design center so if I click on the design center AutoCAD comes with preloaded templates like if I wanted a lamp if I wanted a sofa I would just double click on that hit OK and show an insertion point onto the screen so I just put a couch there I can double click on the table hit OK put in a table now these obviously have to be on a different layer we would call it a furniture layer this is where the furniture is now I could put in more stuff I could put in a wine bar I could put in some table lamps so let's go to the furniture layer I uh, will get maybe a dining set hit OK and I will put that in the dining room I would I can even take some square tables I don't know where I want to put it maybe I would put it in into my living room if I wanted one but again it's up to me I could take a piano double click hit OK throw in a piano and just move and adjust the locations okay so this is how you would put in the interiors now there are more blocks if you would like to go and find it out for yourself I can go house designers click the block I have a bathtub I have a toilet I could click in hit OK and I would put a toilet I can go in and get a bathtub hit OK and I could put a bathtub somewhere 
maybe right here. You can move the toilet, 